These police officers just helped me get out of the mud. I got stuck right here by this river. This is the Parthenon in Centennial Park. It's actually a full-size replica uh, built to celebrate um, Tennessee Centennial and uh, erected around uh, the end of the 19th century. Apparently inside there's a statue of Athena as well. I couldn't go into the Ryman because uh, there's a there's a, like a convention, music convention going on in there, so couldn't go in. Now I'm just on the street in front and I'll just look around a little bit. You're searching for my love, What's your name, man? My name is Mike Slusser. Yeah. And they uh, call me uh, Mandolin Mike here in Nashville. And how'd you learn how to play the mandolin? Um, tough talk. I started with the guitar when I was about oh, 12, maybe. And I uh, didn't pick up the mandolin until I was uh, 26, maybe 27. Uh huh. And uh, and do you mostly just you play out here? Is this called Music Row? Is this what this is? No, this is Lower Broadway. Oh, okay. Um, Music Row is actually 16th and 17th Avenue, and what Music Row is is uh, where where the business of music is. Oh, okay. uh, there are studios up there, and there are publishing houses and record companies and things like that. Uh, so there's really not much to see when you go by Music Row, but it is right. where a lot of uh, historical things have happened. Uh, there's a uh, the RCA studio where a lot of things were recorded in the 60s and the 50s is there, and uh, that's why it's famous. And uh, of course, it is the corporate headquarters for a lot of. Stuff. Also, BMI and ASCAP, the people who keep track of publishing and stuff like that are over there. Right. And can we hear one of your favorite songs? Sure. Uh, let's see. What shall we do? I like a lot of old-time stuff. I like everything, really. Uh, uh, everything from Merle Haggard to, uh, to uh, if you name it. I mean, I do Jimmy Rogers, I do Merle Haggard, I do all the way up to modern songwriters. Uh, and I do my own stuff. But let's see. What shall we do? Uh, let's do some Jimmy Rogers. We'll do some of the earliest country music. This is about 1927 or so. Perfect. And this is called Any Old Time. Wait a minute, we got a truck going by. We'll let it go by. Hazards of the workplace. Yeah. Uh, Give.org? Yeah, EveryoneGives.org. What is it? Uh, you log on. It's sponsored by Colliers International. Log on. Donate to your favorite charity. And that's the simplicity of it? Very that's the simplicity. simplicity. Very cool. And so, uh, do you guys do this every day out here? You're volunteers, I guess? No. no, no. Oh, oops. <laughs> Once a year. It's a short, uh, short campaign that we come up with. I think it lasts about five days. All right. Very cool. pretty interesting that there's music in all these bars on a Wednesday at noon. I think I need to get a haircut, man. 